slice of cabbage, rice, meat, kimchi. There we go. It's like a cabbage boat. Rice, meat, radish, kimchi. Let's make po sum. pretty thick it's not that thin we need the texture it's thick enough for you to chew don't cut it too thin okay one tablespoon salt one cup of cooking syrup and then we're gonna wait for three hours two three four one and a half oh you want to smell it Ooh. one and a half Tuna extract, one, two. Plum extract, one, two, three. Minced garlic, 20 grams. <clears throat> half teaspoon. And this is secret half tablespoons of vinegar to give nice sourness for the radish kimchi. Mix it up. Mmm, leave it for three hours to make it more mature to get rid of roughness of chili powder. Put it in the cold water so you get rid of the sticky thing from the spring onion. This is what all the owners of Busan restaurants do in Korea. They soak the pork in the water for 10 to 15 minutes. Don't peel it off, that's my secret. Put the whole onion in the water. 1.5 This coke is left over from the fried chicken that I ordered yesterday It will make my pork magical with this Soju coke magic for your pork Let's go <coughs> 20 peppercorns 1, 2, 3 I'm kidding Just put 1 tip Soy sauce 1, 2, 3 Garlic Some people will put coffee sometimes but we can't put everything that people put we have enough let's keep it simple okay now it's ready let's put the pork inside no never this is a mistake many people make you must put pork when the water is boiling same thing for putting the meat on the frying pan when it's hot right you don't want to cook your meat when it's cold right let's wait until water starts boiling it's been almost three hours i'm gonna drain the water they came out from the reddish from the reddish Okay. What's very important for this is that it has to be dry. Why? I'm gonna mix these two together. And if it has a lot of moist, it will make water in the end. Mmm! It tastes really good, but not only that, you know, it's always so different when you taste something that you make at home compared to when you eat out at the restaurant. It's so fresh. Finally, the water is boiling. You have to know when to cover the lid or not, okay? So now, for the first 10 minutes, I'm gonna leave it open. And then after that, I'm gonna cover the lid and make it low heat, just enough that it's still boiling, but not too much. Otherwise, the meat will be not tender. Now it's high heat, because it has to be boiling, boiling. See how I'm going to use this. After 10 minutes, like I said, I'm gonna close the lid and boil it for another 30 minutes. 10, 30, 10. It's been 15 minutes already, so I'm gonna turn it around. And now we're gonna give resting for 10 minutes. So no heat, just resting like this. While we're resting the meat, green part of spring onion into this. Give a nice toast. Red, green, sesame seed. I'm very generous when it comes to sesame seed. Resting is done. Look at this. Wow, so soft. Wow. 